Whether it is Legally Blonde, Les Miserables, Sweeney Todd, Into the Woods, or any of the more than 400 shows we've done on this stage, Grease Paint has long demonstrated a commitment to the community. For kids ages 5 to 19, we give them an opportunity to sing, dance, act, dream, and grow. My name's Maureen Diaz, and I'm the executive director here at Grease Paint. I would bet that there isn't a theater artist in the Valley that hasn't been touched by Stagebrush Theater. Many of them have gone on to perform on Broadway, in national tours, or on the professional valley stages. Since Grease Paint was founded in 1984, we've had more than 4,000 kids perform on our stage, and when you add in camps, workshops, and audiences, we are very proud to say that we've affected the lives of tens of thousands of kids and their families. I've been able to travel to New York and see Broadway shows, uh, been to the Gamage and, and seen a lot of great productions over there, but to come here to grease paint and see these young kids perform and know that uh, they have a future of hopefully pursuing their dreams of being actors and actresses uh, at a higher level. It's pretty rewarding to see them do that. My time doing Les Mis, it was so much fun. Like the first second we were there, we all just felt like a family. We all just clicked. And the kids are constantly working, but in the end, it's, it's amazing the difference that you see from the start of the camp to the very end when they put on their production and they're so proud of themselves. I have noticed the most remarkable changes in my children. They, uh, they tend to be a little introverted and shy, especially when they're in new environments and they're meeting new people. And I have watched their confidence levels just blossom this summer. We were thinking about doing The Little Mermaid and Dear Edwina. I would love to be one of the stepsisters in Cinderella. Initially, I donated because my child Berkeley started first and she had such a fabulous experience that we came back over the summer, she did summer camps, and then my younger son decided to also audition for shows and be on stage, and then I just fell in love with the place. Honk, I was a froglet and a geese. Judy B. Jones, I was Herbert, and I did Willy Wonka and I was an Oompa Loompa. My favorite role was probably the bullfrog, also in Honk. Over the past four years, we have seen our audiences grow to the point where our shows are consistently sold out. We've seen the number of kids auditioning here at Grease Paint double. We've seen our classes and our camps and our workshops filled to capacity. It's such an amazing um, organization where these kids, they really get to feel uh, what it's like to be on stage, to be a part of, of a production and to see if that's something that they want to pursue as they get older. Grease Paint is just such an amazing place for so many people. And I mean, not just the kids who are here currently, but the kids who have been here now and are off to college. Because of this success, our 2014-2015 season has six shows. Two of those include adult actors from our community, our family musicals. We offer year-round classes, and we've also started taking Grease Paint out into the community, reaching out to schools who've seen their arts funding cut, offering residencies, after-school programs, and in every way we can imagine, reaching out to the community. We have garnered literally hundreds of nominations and awards for our work here. In the past few years alone, over 50 Zoni nominations and more than 30 National Youth Arts Awards. We want to continue to grow, and my hope is that we can continue to offer opportunities for more kids here, and that's where you come in. On August 26th, Scottsdale Mayor Jim Lane and the City Council voted unanimously to renew our lease on Stagebrush Theater for 10 years. That lease is contingent upon us raising $80,000 for necessary repairs to the building. During the next five months, we have to upgrade our electrical systems, replace our 25-year-old HVAC systems, repair and repaint the exterior of the theater. If you can help, please do so. If you know someone who can help, please introduce them to our little theater company. 
We do big things, and we can continue to do that with your help. And we're in, in the, the brotherhood of men, dedicated to giving all we can. Oh, aren't you proud to be in that fraternity? Because after all, a theater is a theater, no matter how small.